Imagine never being more than 128 kilometers from the beach. Welcome to New Zealand, one of the narrowest countries in the world. No matter where you are in New Zealand, with a coastline of approximately 15,000 kilometers, making it the longest in the world. It comes as no great surprise that water sports, namely surfing, paddleboarding, and whitewater rafting, are pretty huge here. An island country in the southwestern Pacific Ocean, New Zealand is split into the North Island and the South Island. The South is the larger of the two and tends to experience colder climates. However, the North Island, home of Auckland, is both the most visited and populated. Around 5.1 million people live in New Zealand. But amazingly, people are hugely outnumbered by sheep. Recent figures show around 27 million woolly mammals inhabit the country. So that equals around 5 sheep per human. Bah! The two islands are divided by the Cook Strait, named after James Cook, the first European commander to sail through it back in 1770. Though there are ferry services operating daily, the strong tidal flows make it one of the world's most dangerous and unpredictable water areas. Today, the majority of the population is of European descent, along with the indigenous Maori, who were the first settlers on the island. Therefore, the official languages are English, Maori, and New Zealand Sign Language, which was approved by the government in 2006. This makes New Zealand one of only 41 countries worldwide to recognize and honor its deaf community. Maori culture is integral to local life, socially, culturally, and spiritually. Arts, food, customs, and architecture are influenced massively by Maori culture. And who hasn't seen or heard the famous haka, the most passionate, energetic war dance, which symbolizes a group's pride, strength, and unity. This is most notably performed by New Zealand's rugby team, the All Blacks, who are the most successful in the history of international rugby, winning the World Cup three times. Rugby is considered the country's national sport, with golf, cricket, tennis, and netball catching up in recent years. As a developed country, New Zealand holds strong international ties with many powerful countries namely the USA, the UK, and its close neighbor, Australia. It is also a founding member of the United Nations and the Commonwealth. Its economy is advanced and relies heavily on international trade, food products, wood, and wool being its biggest exports. Tourism plays a major role in the economy, and in recent years, the country has been intrinsically linked to the filming of the Lord of the Rings trilogy. There are even tours now set up for visitors to view exact locations from the movies. It is reported that around 200 million U.S. dollars were pumped into the economy as a result of the movies. Long live the hobbits! On a final note, the kiwi. Is it a bird? Is it a person? Or is it a fruit? It is, in fact, all three. Endemic to New Zealand, the bird is flightless. The natives happily answer to their nicknames, and the fruit, well, it's originally from China. Nobody expected that. 